Hey guys! So, I thought I would do a video for y'all. Just because I haven't done one in a while. So, recently I bought this book called The Wrecking Animal by Carrie Smith. Um, basically, what this book is about there's all these different pages, and on these pages you have instructions to do different things that involve either destroying the book, or enhancing the book, or, you know, doodling on the book, or whatever. Um, and I figured it'd be something kind of cool to show you. I've been working on it for approximately two, three weeks, and I've been doing a lot of the pages. Um, it's not complete, it's not done with it. But I figured it'd be cool to show you things that I have done. Um, just so I can show you something. So, this is the print of my record journal. Open to the first page, and I decided to color it with some highlighters. I really like bright colors, and um, that's why I did that one. So here is this page. I have to cover it because it has my address and my phone number. But you're supposed to write your name in all these different types of ways. You know? Um, I did that one. This is the instruction page. I'm still working on it. I want to color the background of it. Uh, I think I want to color it with watercolors. So I still have to work on this one, but I'll read the instructions for you guys. Number one, carry this book or carry this with you wherever you go. So that you follow the instructions on every page. Number three, order is not important. Number four, instructions are open to interpretation. Number five, experiment. Work against your better judgment. So here's the material page, which I'm going to color at some point. And here's uh, the first page, add your own numbers, study here. So start adding numbers, and they're on all the pages back and forth. That's just how I decided to do my numbers. And then on this page, I wrote a bunch of numbers. Comment below if you see your favorite number on this page. Let me know what that number is. Alright. The next page. The crack the fine page, which I cracked the fine. So I've cracked. Um, I think I want to do a some kind of doodle on that, but I'll do it later. And then this says, leave this page blank on purpose. But there's nothing on that page. So this next page says to stand here, wipe your feet, jump up and down. So, I did stand on it. Um, it's very faint, but there's some of the dirt that was on my foot. Um, I made stuff on it again. And then this one says, Four still drip six. Fling your coffee here. So I had an iced latte, and I spilled it on the page. So it was cool to see. Blood is there. It doesn't really smell like coffee. And then this one says to poke holes in this page using a pencil. So I went ahead and poked a bunch of holes. Whoops. See? There's a hole. So this page says to draw fat lines, fat thin. The fat line to thin line. Pressing really hard with the pencil. There's my fat and my thin lines. I see a lot of books out there that are very, very, you know, colorful, very intricate. But I just decided to be kind of okay. I kind of follow the direction and that's it. So this one says to color this entire page. So I did a bunch of colors. In a circle. I like this page because it's very colorful. I like color! See the next page that I did. So, scratch using a sharp object. What I did is it says, 
Without pain, there would be no growth. I scratched it with a needle tool while I was in art class. And then the next page says do some rubbing with the pencil. So the first one is a sticker. What else is on there? The remote. Um, some gems. A couple of pennies. A fork. This next one says scribble wildly and violently with reckless abandon. So I did. I scribbled a lot of crayons. Um, Alright. This next page is tear, strip, strip, rip it up. So I went ahead and I tear the strips. Um, some people color their strips, but I didn't do it. I may color it later. It just depends on what I want to do. So, and this next one will be kind of fun. It says, chew on this. Warning, do not swallow. So I went ahead and I chewed on the page. I actually, I actually chewed like a hole through it. Oh, there we go. See? Chew the hole. Oh, maybe you can't see. I don't know. I chew the hole through it. Uh, well, I chew them up. Then this one says to tear it out and crumple. So I tear it out and crumple it. And I glued it back in the book. Then. So the page within here, I think, it said, uh, tear out the page, put it through the wash, and put it back in the book. I did, I tore it out, and I put it in my pocket, in the wash, and I locked it. It didn't come out in the wash. Let's see what else I have here. A lot of things I haven't done yet, but I will. This is a work in progress. Make a paper chain. So you have all these little areas to do stuff. A lot of people do like designs or patterns, but I did a bunch of colors. I just like bright colors. Um, but I'm gonna cut it out and glue it together, and I'll show you that one. What I've done. Um, this is another one that's a work in progress. Uh, says to. Uh, Collect food stickers here. Uh, stickers you find on bought fruit. So I don't buy much fruit. I don't really remember to grab the stickers off the fruit. But this is one that is going to be kind of difficult for me to finish. Uh, let's see what else I did. Oh. So this is a test page. So. Use this as a test page for pens, paint, markers, or art supplies. So I tested a bunch of pens that I had in my bag on it. This has some work to be done to it also. The next page says drip something here, ink, paint, tea, close the book, and make a print. So I dripped some nail polish and uh, close the book, and this is the print I got. Um, it's a really cool nail polish. It's, um, what is it? OPI, liquid sand, and then this blue one is Ulta. Uh, let me know what you see in the pattern. Comment down below what kind of shapes or, or pictures you see while looking at this. There's quite a few that I didn't work on. This one I saw more to do. I didn't have much in my pocket at that time, but it says, trace the items in your pocket, let the line overlap. The only thing I had in my pocket at that time was a bottle of Belladon, so I traced that. This next one says, scribble wildly using only borrowed pens. Document where they are from. So I have a couple, I have some words on this one. 
I borrowed this pen from my friend Nina on the 19th. Alright. This next one says ask a friend to do something destructive to this page. Don't look. So we were in art class and we had some ceramic slip. And so she decided to put slip and water on the page and close it. And this is actually a very messy page. So I just got it all over my computer. Let's do okay. other stuff. I can find. Thank you. So this one says, Close your eyes and connect the dots from memory. So, I closed my eyes and I tried to connect the dots. This is what I came up with. Totally missed it. Totally missed the mark. That's okay. It's all the fun. Um, I really like this page. I still have more to do with this page. Um, it says, hang the journal in a public place and invite people to draw here. This is the drawings that I already have currently. The drawings from Magic the Gathering, a heart, a smiley face, and a flower. But I'm going to see if I can get people to add to it. This one says, shake your hand. I trace my right and my left hand. I may color them in and turn them into turkeys. Let's see what else. I don't know. I still have a lot to do with this book. Um, you know, I just kind of did different pages. Okay, this one says create a non stop line. So there it is, there's my non stop line. There's the start. This one, um, there's a little tear right there. This is for a page that said, uh, lose this page and count it as a loss. Uh, that was kind of cool. You know. And then the next page is a page for four letter words. And so I had some highlighters at the time. I really like using highlighters for stuff. Uh, but these are some of the words. Uh, if you find a word on here that you really enjoy, well, we know what it is. So I'm like, well, let me read you some of these words. Right? Tone. Food. Love. Moon. Yeah. Play, tons, drum, pink, cell, thick book, thing, blue, well, page, word, hope, eat, four, with no feet, feet and four. So those are some four little words. Oh, no, no. Okay, else. This is what I'm still working on. This is a stain log. A couple of stains I have. This is a pink hair mascara. There is purple hair mascara and slip. But I still have to work on that one. Okay. And then the next page said, figure out how to attach these two pages together. So I just staple them together. That's all. I wore this book. This one says, drum on this page with the pencil. And so there are all my little, I did it with some colored pencils, so there are my little pencil caps. Ah, this is 
This page said to cover this page with duct tape or just regular tape and create a pattern. So I have some yellow and some camo duct tape in my backpack. So I just covered this page with duct tape. And that is all. I did for this book. Um, I hope you liked that. Let me know if you would like me to post an update after I've done some more pages. If so, let me know down below. Um, also, if you would like to see the pages I've done in the another book from from this author named uh, This Is Not A Book. It's sort of the same kind of concept, but it's taking a book and using it to become another thing. For example, uh, this is not a book, it's a recorder. And so what you would do is you would record what you did that day. You would also record things like how many times you went in and out of a room. Uh, there's another page that says this is a conversation starter. And so you use that page to start a conversation. And stuff like that. Let me know if that's something you want to see. And I will uh, work on getting that video out to you guys. I want to thank you for watching this long video. And if you have any other suggestions for a video, let me know down below. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and until my next video, I'll see you guys later.